The new orbit bus system is about a month from hitting the road. Tonight, new information about the new bus stops and how they will look. It's like a makeover before it even begins. Liliana Pearson is live. John and Lauren, I'm at an orbit bus stop, and this is pretty much what they all look like. But take a look at this electrical box over here. You can see that it's bursting with color and covered in local Nebraska foliage. And this is just one of a handful of electrical boxes next to orbit bus stops that are getting a new unique look. The project started as a concept, a marriage between art and infrastructure. Those are two of the uh, ingredients of a really vibrant and dynamic city. Scott Dobby with Omaha by Design and, and artist Weston Thomas have been hunting for the perfect canvas. Not so visible every day, those in-between spaces. We're looking at retaining walls, we're looking at um, underpasses, we're looking at alleyways, um, utility boxes, anything that maybe people might overlook. And they found it when they saw the sleek orbit bus stops being installed. Kind of a, a moving art gallery, so to speak. Ten artists were each assigned a bus stop to add their own unique style, from wildflowers to pop art. The work will be as diverse as the people creating it. It's just something that we felt that um, uh, it would really kind of enrich and, and add some vibrance to the city. The hope is to eventually decorate all the orbit bus stops. But with the oncoming winter, they're focusing on what can be accomplished in the coming weeks. It's an installation they want the local community to be proud of, and an addition to the city that keeps visitors coming back. Infuse some art and joy and creativity in a dark time. So we can start to envision the city as a dynamic, vibrant, creative place. November 18th is the first day that orbit starts running and the day that you'll finally be able to see the first of these handfuls of art installations. On your side, Liliana Pearson, 6 News. All right.